Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West where I just checked my save files and it's been a literal month and a half since I've opened the game. <laughs> oh, I've been so busy. I, uh, as I think, I don't know where I explained it, I'm actually exhausted too. I didn't sleep well at all last night so I apologize if I'm a little woozy. Um, but I had to go just now because I had to quit here. It didn't autosave afterwards, so I had to go through the Eleuthia conversation, which I had totally forgotten about. The cuts or the the loading screen was like, "You have a thing with Eleuthia," and I was like, "What? Okay, por qué? What?" Um, but I have gone through as I usually have to on my skills and like re familiarized myself. <laughs> But once again, I apologize. My combat is gonna is gonna suck. <gasps> oh shoot! This is um. Okay, I actually was like, oh, I'll do the Eleuthia thing. Why? Mm, this dang nab drifting controller. I'm gonna have to lose. I'm just gonna have to scream. Maybe I'll get a pretty one. I thought this was just going to be on the list, but apparently everything is on hold until we contact Luthia. Great. Sorry, I was seeing if she was drifting. Um, okay, let's go do that. I, Varl did say just now that um, him and Aaron, Erland, uh, why am I Aaron? Erland, who's... Who is that? <laughs> why is my brain thinking that's a name? Um... I was able oh to shoot, really? In the main area. Good to know. I'll check it out when I can. Where? It's gonna be a trek to get to the people who died. Yeah, it'll be nice to trick my Oh. Well I don't know, actually I can't see the location because I have to talk to Varl. I'm drifting! I don't quite understand this. You do you, you doing okay? Do you require my sword? Not right now. I need to get going. I will continue my training. He's <laughs> He would be the angry orb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean it served it it was Where's that music the Osirum plays? <laughs> I knew he of course he would like that. Anyway, no, okay, this is not what I want to do in here. I'm distracted by people. I need to upgrade things. I will go be Why can't I poke this? What is it? I will be right back. I will do things. I will get my head on straight. Gaia, what was this room for? This was intended to be a recreational room for control center. Oh. Unfortunately, the entertainment modules were lost. Apollo did. Let's do that. Freaking Ted Farrow has so much to answer for, including the loss of video games. Ah, oh, I'm gonna burn him. <laughs> if I ever find his clone, if he has a clone. Somebody brought that up as a possibility and I was like, oh my gosh, you know, like, we were just spitballing ideas. And, uh, it was, it was like, if I find his clone, I'm gonna freaking find it, I'm gonna burn it too. Rage. I have rage. Okay, done several upgrades. Fully upgraded the adhesive blast sling. Um, did a couple other things. This was tempting to finish out, but I am running out of money. Money! So I will not do it. But I did a fully upgraded the adhesive blast sling that has explosives and. Oh, I didn't even. 
Think about my armor. Oh my gosh. I don't have the. What do you, what do you want? Oh, wow. A sunwing. No, I have to destroy a sunwing. I was going to have to eventually. I need to go. An iridescent crab shell. Oh my gosh. I need to go murder some more animals. Many animals. Better watch out. Okay, got more resources to fill up what I just made. Let's do this. Let's wake up, brain. Oh boy, let's go, let's go, brain, brain, brain. Too bad, I was like, oh, I was. I should change my face paint to try to match my armor because I really like it. I don't even, what am I, sorry, right. I gotta look and see what my armor does. Alright, until I can get my face paint changed, I'm gonna wear matching armor. I've just for the for the the aesthetics it's really not um once I once I have to switch armors for other things I will <laughs> There she is. Hello, I changed. You ready to head out? Yeah, you know, let's just let's go. Let's do it. Let's jump right in. Let's go. Look at us. Three battle-hardened badasses forging into the unknown. This ought to be good. <laughs> Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited. I actually get to go with my friend. Oh, dang. They don't even have to run. They're not even going to make me pathfind with them. Distress call. Had to be up a really steep mountain, huh? Honestly, I'm surprised he can do this because I don't think the Ostermen tra are trained in, like, rock climbing. Lenora are. That's part of their part of their initiation. The Alcerum are trained to wield hammers. <laughs> I'm impressed. Ah! Uh, <gasps> Her armor is so cool. Taking notes. Oh shoot! Okay, so they were able to take down her shield. Well, takes the keg. Wow, with that whip, with the big one, and then he was able to stab her. <laughs> the the first weapon attack didn't kill her, didn't hurt her. It just broke her shield. Burl, see if there's anything over there. On it. I love that we just watched that, to we'll be honest. That we didn't do, like, the hero. Like, the hero thing of, like, jumping in and being like, I gotta save you guys! It's like, look. Well, there are obviously more Zeniths than we know about. Like... I can't believe you fought one of them. Almost didn't make it. I can't believe she died. I kind of thought they were just invincible, but, I mean, they had to not be, obviously. But, uh, Wow. Their, their clothes the are so cool. Blanketing the land. Whatever the rebels did, it took down her shield. I mean, she's only human. But why was she here? I can access her last communication file, but I'll use my focus to scan the battlefield too. What about that crazy weapon the Zenith had? It looked like a it plasma. Looks like she can make it come and go at will. Oh. But it's gone now. It's interesting. Yeah. Well, go do your thing. I'll wait here. Thanks, bud. Farbina. Is she gonna come back from the dead? I almost feel like she's gonna come back from the dead. What, what am I supposed to be? It was like, oh, inspect the battlefield. And also I can access her last memory thing or whatever. Yo! Is this a new machine? I think it is a new machine. Like, it looks like a... The Spectre had instructions to... assist recovery of the asset. I wonder what this asset is. 
Spectre? Do I... Do I know what Spectres are? Continue monitoring V Setter Verbane. I assume it's that lady over there. So that's really great that these guys were able to bring it bring it down. It looks very spooky. Very Mass Effect Andromeda, but I only say that because I played it first. <laughs> Oh, wow, I have so much wood. Okay. I was just kind of worried for some reason. Oh, more. Okay, 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 okay. <gasps> Bunny. Okay, actually, this is actually needs to be addressed. and Because I've been editing my videos. And I'm like, why am I doing this? But I am... I This drift is so annoying. Um, I need a weapon that just has plain old arrows. Like, ones that aren't using machine muscle all the time. Okay, these ones are normal ones. Oh, okay. So I did fix that. Okay. It's just been a while. And I actually haven't, been, haven't quite finished, I think, uploaded. No, yeah, I think I have, like, one or two more episodes that I need to finish. Um, editing. I got distracted. Looks like the rebels camped here for a while. Are they watching this area? I wonder if relationships are going sour, because I was kind of assuming that Far Zenith was helping the rebels just to, like, cause some chaos or something. Like, so somehow it was going to, like, factor into their plans. But maybe things have gone south of it, or I'm just totally wrong. An Osiru, I was like, is that Osiru armor? Looks like he was sending data on the weapons somewhere else. Interesting. Was the weapon self-destructing or the focus? The weapon self-destructed, but it looked like it kind of overheated. That's wild. Ah. Ah. Our weapon's still hot. I need to know how it worked. But I'll have to check on it once it's cooled off. Throw some snow on it. All right. I think I have an idea what happened here. I better get back to Erend. Yeah, well, there's stuff to loot, so give me give me a hot second. Aaron could just, like, you know, he could do stuff, too. He's a strong, independent man. I swear there was more. Maybe not. This is like, this is like, yeah, this had, this is one of theirs. This is one of the Far Zenith ones that I don't think I've ever seen. So I'm just, do I have it in my notebook? We have new character bios. Who? Oh. Okay. She was the one who helped us, I think, when we were fighting the giant snake, which I just... I think I just edited that video. It's, it's a blur. Eleuthia. Oh boy, let's see. Yeah, okay. I wonder what... What the devs have in mind for her instead of just having her like turn off. They obviously kept her for a reason, you know? I'm curious. All right, she who sees the unseen. What did you find out? This was a carefully planned attack. I found camping gear up there. The rebels must have been staking out this place for at least a few days. They were waiting for the Zeniths to show up. All so that they could test that weapon. The Zeniths have a personal shield that makes them invulnerable, but somehow the weapon got rid of it. The Osirum that was operating, it was sending data on it somewhere else. It was probably just a prototype. I've known tinkers that do that. I'd do a little 
trial run before breaking out the real thing? Well, I guess it's still a work in progress, if it blew up. She was searching for something she lost. Her drone had instructions to recover something called the Asset. The Asset? Is that the uh, sub-function thing that you said could be here? The Luthia? I'm not sure. Come on, let's go talk to Varl. That's a good point. I was like, I don't freaking know what it is. Um, but why? That's interesting that there's somebody, there's another group out here. The, rebel, the rebels are also out here, like, trying to, like, test prototypes. Uh, maybe the rebels forged the signal to lure that woman here so they could test their zenith killing weapon on it and what was it made out of like i want to look at it properly like what technology do we have down here i mean i guess we have the machines and they have insane like pretty insane technology like technological capabilities and destruction powers oh boy That's a long way down. Something tunneled straight down into the mountain. Looks recent. It was definitely... Whatever it was, it must have been powerful. <clears throat> it was definitely... That zenith the rebels killed was looking for something called... The Asset. I don't know what it is, but my guess is it's somewhere down there. All right, so we head down. Erend, stay here and stand watch. That zenith isn't the only one of its kind. I don't want to be caught by surprise if the others show up. Contact us by focus if you see anything. Okay. If any trouble shows up, I'll call. Yeah, you better like Let's run, go. my dude. Wait, when you just like jump in? No. <gasps> that was odd. What is this mountain made of? There's some kind of old world ruin down here. You said the Zeniths have their own backup of Gaia, right? Yeah, from the Proving Lab. So maybe they were after Eleuthia. Found its hiding spot, so it sent the distress signal. Maybe. Maybe it's running because it's, it's inhabited something else. I was like, it's definitely the massless software that, uh, that tunneled this hole. But to be fair, it could do what Hades did and inhabit something... Which way do you want me to go? Because I don't, I want to go the, okay, that way. I want to go the opposite. Varl, I'm going to lose my mind, bud. Whoop, that's not, mm, let me. This is fun, though. It's fun to have friends. See, Aloy, it's fun to have friends. This is just nothing. Okie dokie. All right, I'm just. Just a dead end. <laughs> kind of... This was like a... I'm just... Storage facility? It could be many things. There's storage within facilities. <laughs> Looks like some oh. kind of data center. Yeah, yeah, with these towers. I might be able to access the facility systems from our <gasps> console. Oh, never mind. I was like, it's Apollo, but no. We are talking about Eleuthia. My end goal, though, is to get Apollo back and find Ted Farrow's spirit and clone and beat the crap out of them. Storage units access, data transfer initiated, operation suspended, fusion reactor on. Doesn't give me dates though. Destination, reach, re blah, blah, blah. I don't know if there was pauses or if those were all like within. Like, I mean, I know they were one after the other, right? They were obviously chronological. Is that it? Just, just, just that in this. Uh, whoa! Oh, what is this? Oh, I thought it was a sword. <laughs> I was like, wow, I get a sword. Oh, this looks like a far zenith transmitter, potentially. 
Because it's all pretty and gold and white. I've never seen a transmitter like this before. Oh, Looks man. Looks like it's self-destructed. Oh, sword. I was so excited. I was like, oh, but King Arthur, I'm going to pull the sword out. It's going to be great. This was a far seen as research. Oh, lab. this wasn't one of. Looks like a lot of data was beam cast from here recently. From that device nearby. Oh, interesting. So the is gone? If it was ever here, then probably. Did they already steal her? But then why were the Xenos oh. still searching for the assets? That's true. Let's keep looking around. I keep thinking the assets Aloy, but they really don't. They they would not consider Aloy an asset. Aloy is something to be destroyed because they already have a clone. So, exploring another far zenith. That's true, room. that's true, my friend. At least this one doesn't seem to have giant killer oh, machines. Oh, you spoke too soon. Oh, far, I'll tell her. She spoke too soon. Um, I forget that far zenith would have, like, we had that ruin, obviously, at the beginning, but it's like, oh, yeah. Or anything you can blow up. Oh, my gosh. That was a very delayed response, but you're right. You also spoke too soon on that. Um, but it's just interesting that this isn't this isn't one of Elizabeth Sobeck's ruins, which we're used to kind of, or not necessarily Elizabeth Sobeck, but you know. Which way do you want me to go? Cause I, I'm gonna go up, cause I'm gonna assume down is. Where do you want me to go? Ah, there's doors. No. Let me in. I could totally slip through there. Aloy's tiny. I could take off my armor and get in there. Aloy, oh my gosh. She's like acting like she's freezing to death. Here, put on the fur armor so your midriff isn't exposed. Ectogenic chambers. Oh no! Like the ones I saw inside a zero. This is where I was supposed study. to go. What were they for? Remember when I told you I was made, not born? This is how. A machine that makes a person. That's incredible. Yeah. I was like, oh yeah, I'm still uh, still working on that actually. From Daniel Miguel to Claire Nguyen, Spoonfit. Claire wishes you'd on the call with me with Zerodon. Whoever negotiated this deal with them is ingenious. A bunch of our old tech collecting dust into storage in exchange for a copy of all human knowledge. Talk about a bargain. And the guy heading up the Eleuthia sub function, Patrick Brochard Klein, you could practically see sparkles in his eyes when he was bombarding us with follow up questions on the Ectogenic Chambers design. It was like we were waving catnip in front of him. Anyway, they're requesting additional material on nutrition delivery. Higher ups gave the go ahead, so send everything we over everything we have. Brochard Klein will probably pee his pants in glee. So they obviously then have ha have an advanced ectogenic function. This was like the stuff they gave that worked for us, that worked for Zero Dawn, was like. This place keeps on going. We better check in that room. It was uh, like their prototype stuff. Did I? Wait. Yeah. Okay. And, and it obviously worked really well. Like it birthed a whole new generation of humans, but now that begs the question what did they do up in their spaceship? Okay, this video may be a bit short, but. I need to call it here. So thank you all so much for joining me. I appreciate it. Um, we will hop back into the rest of this. I hope we could find Aluthia. I don't know. Maybe she is gone now. Maybe she ran away. Maybe she escaped. But also we got to figure out what made this tunnel. How exciting. Um, thank you again for watching. I just keep thinking of Aloy being like, no big machines to kill when she just walked through a giant hole bored in through the side of a mountain. Anyway. 
thank you all so much for watching i appreciate it really quick i want to say thank you to my patrons to all my patrons but to especially reese galito my sapling tier patron thank you so much for your support and an extra special shout out to my two tree tier patrons chris and adam so thank you both so much for your support i really really appreciate it a lot um you guys are the super bestest truly so thank you guys again. I'm sorry. I'm trying to wake up. I don't know what it is. <laughs> Just can't. Oh, it's going to be a long day. Thank you all again. And I'll see you in the next one.